Brightest blessings, everyone. Elizabeth Grove here, the Paranormal Priestess. Welcome to the Paranormal Priestess YouTube channel, and thank you so much for joining me today. If you are new to the channel, welcome. My name is Elizabeth. I am a medium, divine channeler, remote spirit extractor specialist, white witch, and divine alchemist, and I also happen to be a divine twin flame on the path to reunion. I hope that everyone is doing well out there. It's really good to see all of you. And this video, I am so happy to bring forth to you because this is going to be an extremely powerful light language transmission coming straight from Archangel Michael himself to set you and your beloved free. If you are on the Twin Flame journey, Ascension journey, you're a star seed, angelic, you're definitely going to want to stay tuned all throughout this video, I'm going to talk a little bit about some of the energies that I've been receiving, uh, about the current energies, and I'm going to explain basically what this powerful transmission will do for you and for your beloved to help set you free. Um, this is what I received that would best benefit the collective at this time, so I'm really happy, really honored to be able to bring this forth. So what's been happening now on the Ascension journey is that it just feels like we're in this pressure cooker, right? Everything is coming to a head. It's like this breaking point. And basically what I was receiving is that we are being challenged to let go of control very, very strongly. So where the mind wants to control, where we've been holding on to what hasn't been serving us, um, holding on to old identities, holding on to people who no longer serve us, holding on to habits, behaviors, addictions, whatever the case may be, um, holding on to the past, anything and everything that hasn't been serving us, we are at this breaking point where we just can't sustain that any longer. This is a time where the path is opening up very, very quickly, and it's going to be for us to truly surrender to the higher powers, really surrender to the path, surrender over to divine will, what, what the divine has in store for us, what your higher self and the higher self or your beloved has in store for you, and really, really trust that. Um, we are releasing things very, very quickly and closing down things from the past very, very quickly. Um, so many of these things have to do with bloodline limitations, beliefs, limitations, things that we have gone through, that we have seen, that we have chosen in other lifetimes, many of the timelines and dimensions, all of these sorts of things. We're also in this retrograde energy. So even though Mercury retrograde didn't officially start yet, we're in this shadow period of Mercury retrograde right now, uh, you know, depending on the time that you're watching this video. Um, and that's going to be about going back. It's going to be about going back and addressing things that maybe we were in denial of. Maybe we were trying to hold on to something because it was just too painful or it was too scary to let go because we're fear fearful of change, right? Um, we are going to definitely be feeling the strain of resistance if we, there has been resistance there of, say, we've been getting the guidance, we've been getting the signs and synchronicities that we need to make certain changes in our life. We need to make that concrete, right? Make it manifest. And we haven't been doing that. We are definitely going to be feeling the strains of that. And the tower moments will absolutely be happening. Uh, karma contracts and things like that will be ending and this this is where this video is going to be coming in very very handy uh, I actually through my channeling I received that I will be delivering a this is what they want me to do deliver a, a light code to you guys and this actually is going to be light code 5321 okay 5321 so with this particular light code, what it really is signifying is, well, let's talk about you know breaking down the numbers. And this is how I received it. See how you resonate. Some of you may be into numerology and things like that, but this is just how I channeled it. Um, 
With the fives, a lot of that is about very major change, making change, where there's been conflict, when, where there's been chaos, where things haven't quite been working out. It's time now to transform in order to bring about freedom. So five is also a number of freedom, Ch making changes and allowing freedom to come. Um, it's also about you know the mind, freeing your mind. Right, allowing your mind to expand, therefore you're able to um, manifest, like five is the number of manifestations, to manifest uh, amazing change. So we have the freedom, and then we have threes. Threes are, of course, about unity, unity consciousness. It's also about completion. It's about, you know, understanding that we're all unified. It's to uh, approach the world in a unified way. It's to be unified and balanced within. So balance within, unified within, allows us to do that also in our physical reality. So there's that. And all these numbers will be working together. We have twos. The twos, of course, are about two people, two parties, relationship, twin flames. And we have the ones. The ones are about your individuality, what you're meant to authentically bring that no one else can bring, allowing your beautiful, unique, strong, powerful nature to really make a difference in the world. So 5321 is the light code that I'm going to be delivering. Archangel Michael is going to be assisting me with this. And basically what this light language will be for is to help you and your beloved be set free within your soul Akashic records. So these are the things that come up. I'm a channeler and a medium. I do reading sessions all the time, personal reading sessions. And as we're going through our ascension processes, it's, it's truly about becoming free, right? Being free from the past, being able to then allow this higher light body in place um, and allow us to get to five-dimensional being, right? Be that five-dimensional being, allowing our vibration to be high, frequency to be high, and unifying our chakra system with our beloved, having that merge take place. But what often takes place is that we are... Um, still connected to the past in ways that are contracts, karmic contracts, uh, cords, threads, and hooks. So that could be to people, that could be to um, beings, dark beings. Uh, it could be anything from like uh, demonic types of stuff, malicious souls, to AI type of stuff. All, all those cords, threads, and hooks can exist. Many times that seems to happen. Um, Things like promises and agreements that were not really serving us, right, in the other lifetimes. And, you know, for all these things, sometimes it's a conscious thing where we're consciously giving our permission, conscious, consciously entering into a contract or agreement. And other times it's just, you know, subconsciously accepted in some way. Um, and this bleeds through. This bleeds through from those lifetimes into the current lifetime, basically preventing you from moving forward, preventing you from being your higher authentic self, preventing you from, you know, moving forward on your ascension journey uh, into your twin flame reunion, uh, going forth into your mission, you know, your, your mission with your beloved, all of those things. So what I was told is that this is going to be freedom here that's going to be granted for you, that divine will basically is coming in and saying, hey, it's time to free all of these twin flames, these, these beings who are here for their ascension, free them from the past. The divine wants to do that for you and, and help to clear those Akashic soul records. So that way you guys can move forward and be who you're meant to be. Do what you, you're meant to do, what you plan to do, to be of service, to bring the love. So this is a really important and, I would imagine, very powerful light language transmission. And I, I really am looking forward to hearing, you know, how this felt, anything that you might have seen, you know, if you have any kind of visions there or the energy that you felt. And I would love to hear about this. And please understand that as all of these cords, hooks, threads, everything, the contracts are caught, every, you know, things are set free here, that, you know, there will more than likely be a purging period, a release period for yourself and your beloved to cleanse out 
that energy, right? Because the energy has to still um, come out. You know, it still has to be consciously processed and, and cleared out. But this is going to be a way to um, to give you guys freedom. So what I would do, of course, is I would set that intention that this is what you would like at this time, that you're accepting uh, this light code for 5321, this union light code, this code of freedom, um, that this light language is going to be assisting you who is watching this and hearing this now in the ways which are in the highest good as per your higher self. Okay, as per what's best for your journey, for your path. And I am setting that intention that I am giving that um, the transmission that's going to be assisting the collective in this way um, in the highest good, as, as intended, as the divine intends, as Archangel Michael intends. And he will be working through me, as I said. Now, uh, after this transmission is over, you may want to drink some water. I think that's a really good idea because as you are shifting energy here to drink a lot of water, maybe rest a little bit. You can be feeling some things. You could be feeling energy. You might feel a little tired. Some of these things may come out, um, you know, the next day or something like that. So that's very, very true too. Um, but this is going to be, uh, this light code is going to be in the ways which is going to set you free. Um, in the ways that are in the best for you. Anything that, that's there that would be impeding your ascension path, your ascension process, that's still connected to your Akashic soul records for you and your beloved, okay? So you're just accepting that. Okay. So I'm about to begin. A drosu solo menani kine se shuna sa sani kindre. O drosu so mia kanra kine kadre se tu yesu shuanya kia asa soya nie se kio tu avie. E dro nia kara so so kat nia kasa so asa kane se nie te kishu shumia. Aia, o dro kopi kadre se kanra di indre so mia te ya tu a la tu kara se sonia tre kine kishu a. E drogo do muso, e shro do kushi mia to kushi mia sasia. O drogo mia kane sa kane ya sa kale le kia tua shendra sanye e te kia dro sonyo ya. A drogo mia kane dro sonyo ya te kia la rnun tu e peke te kia sa sinye shendre se sua te kia la tuma tu kwa mega tu kwa ma tu kwa rashi shumu ya. O drogo mia e re kino tu e shiki ni si si o tan a i nira kuntu kore e re kine te kishin o tu e a la. E do kondro so zo peke. In the key to go strap near to Casalarin, the Keller, the right to Nebeke or a Coney or a Sawyer as a Sanyakua. A Kunudu to wash a shati kishika, Nudu to be air, Niki, the Kero Sukaras a Satani Kondoya Kalare. A duenya, the Kula la Sun to us at the key, the Kora in the Kishin, yes, the sea to Kundu to us a Kalia la the Kundra Kiat near she. A drondu and the Arikinia Krasas ne. E te kine ki anua te ki o shnu ni tu sunu du se kadra la ritu ndre ke dra le sani e kine yu shu o te a. O ndo ndo nga ari a kanari kane sa ke are kane se si a eri hindi. O ndo du du shniri ki a mne konu ra so mi a mne ra kanare te ki e sa ala tnto a te ku shu no ro so nere a. E dru kundu ko shni a sa sa ya le kindi di ki he te ki u dru shukuru sundu a ne kadara sa ta ki di ki a tu a nara te ki shu a ni sa. E dru se mire, e dru ka sukuna mi a te ki a te ko a nara ushtere bi a te ka sa sa nya ki ni a e dru ko u nya du ushtere ni a su ko a a ya sha sha ka ne se ko shni ki a te ku cha pe ke da ke ra. E oro ko lo ko su kadro su pe ya te ri ki nya ki a te ko ushtere sa si. エンドコーニンビキアリキニャケタキシアレセセサイヤアンドコーテケエセネケララッションデビヤエンドラッネエレイオントトウシカタダガサカダネサアチシネレセシエンドコドロプグシュアセセネテテイツトクニャアニシ
eto gopia karas sta kadra kinya rakinya de kashisa si e du she bikin do ko to be shi adres se ya nyu to a khane te ke khane de ka yer se se adra ke are o khra khani to ko to ko shi de re su tu e shi de de ki sa khane de de ki ne ke la se si ne re se su a dro so ko ni de ki do ko shu ru mi a su su mi a dra 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 ki ne dra se ki ne ta ki shi ni re se re re sa ta ti e sha to a do khoro mi na no ma da ti na to ko to ni sin ta ki ara le tu to shi ne re sa sa ri ni te te e su ko ye de ki a sha sa la la le e ro ko ro ko ro shu mi de so do do yi ni shi ki ni se se ki a sa ki a de in de so so nya ti a sha ki ni re ki a tra o ni do be ki shi de ni ni ki a ne sa sa ni te ku shi ni re sa sa re ti so do do e shi ni la re ko do e su yo a e khnu dum han re ki ro ko tro so so mi ape ke tro ki a sho tro ka ni adra sa ni a an do ko do sa 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 ni et ne ke da ni a se se ki e dri se se re a la do a la le te so mi a adro ka bi ka dra so tum be ni a ni a ta ko shi ni a dra so ko ni yo sho ma na tu a ta ki a dra ni e e dri ki dra ka se se ta ki a dro so a ta shi ni e e do ko so sa mi a dra ki a do i ni ka la do ko a shi ki re se ki e dri andro so ko bu tu shinere ri no se se ka bi ga shinu te ku shinere shi ga re sne ke re re do di akla khuru so kho ni te ke te ku shinere te so ra re shne re ki adra sa tre ke alla do do e khuru do ba ri ko do na ve ke no tu a ni ke tu tu a te ke la to ko do sne re ne ke ara sa sa te min di shi sa se se ti ne te ki mi ri shne ri ni shinere ra ko do sho te ra sa ni a dre ni un drusso che ha tenuto il secchio un drusso che ha messo in giro la sua o dro che ha inviato così che ha tenuto il carasso tre tre che ha tenuto il drusso o coro che ha messo il secchio il secchio il drusso che ha tenuto 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 il secchio il drusso a to se bi to do ya sinye e to do sinye no to sinye e to to do sinye to do sinye a to to do sinye a no do sinye e tri ki to go mi an to ya sinye a ya so ya e so so ya khara ni ki ni rek no to bishi a tri sinye a to rok ni ke a tri ko shi ni bishi sinye a Breathe, release, and allow this freedom energy to come in for yourself and your beloved. A clearing, a cutting free from the past, allowing you both to be free to move forward on your path, to surrender to the path, to be aligned with the path, to allow that unity be, to be within, to allow yourself to shine, to allow your true soul to come about, to be there within the world, to be that example, to be that template, to anchor that higher light. It is now time. It is absolutely now is the time and the divine is pushing all of us to truly surrender to this path and wishing you all the brightest of blessings. Thank you so much for joining me for this transmission. If you are interested in contacting me, I am here for personal reading sessions. I am here for personal light language healings, where we'll trans actually do a transmission that is for you personally, whatever it is that I channel. So I do have those sessions as well. Uh, there's spirit extractions as well. Uh, right now I'm getting the sign to take a little bit of a, of a break there just because of the lunar eclipse and mercury retrograde energies, but I will be coming back with that. 
But for all my services, to know about me, to read my testimonials, some of my story, you can go to theparanormalpriestess.com. I will leave all of my contact information in the description below. Thank you. Please don't forget to subscribe to the channel so you don't miss anything. And I will see you all soon. Christ lessons, everybody. And remember, from the heart of the darkness is born the light. Bye-bye.